I'm Vic the Cruz, and you're watching Flea Market Coin Hunters. Thank you for tuning in to Flea Market Coin Hunters. And we're back with another episode. Right now, I just picked up Boogie. Boogie's another YouTuber. He does video games. Um, he's my little brother. And uh, he's gonna come with us. Um, hopefully, he can uh, hold the camera for us for a little bit and do some shots. So, uh, let's get to the road again. Oh yeah, we just hit some monstrous highway traffic. One exit away. Isn't that so fun? Oh well, we'll be there in a minute. Why am I so emotional? No, it's not a good look, gain some self-control. Deep down I know this will never work. But I'm late with me so it doesn't hurt. Hold on to the flea market checking it out this is actually the last day so uh, this is a big bargain day so yes um, let's try to break deals and uh, see what we can find look for some riches yeah there's a Big, big, big area. The silver! Yeah. But, uh, slabbed coins. PCGS slabbed coin. See, that's a real slabbed coin. Oh, look at those collectible baseballs. Nice, very nice. So, I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to break a deal with these right now. I got these out on the tables talk and these are just awesome as well look at that guys yes yes go to your local flea market that is a good place to start so this is boogie's forte right here some PSP games, he likes the games, PS3 games, PS2 games and blu ray games look at that look at these cards that's awesome all right and we're back with the final pickup and what we had broke a deal was on these awesome Bicentennial. These are, uh, let's see, the certifications on the bottom. And I believe these are, those right here, these are Bicentennial ones. Um, this one and this one has the um, certification card and... Um, Straight still in the cell, the cellophane from the mint, and then um, the reverse that's the same as that one, which that one doesn't have the book for some reason. This one does, and this one's uh, Paul Revere, and um, this is another uh, John Adams, right? Yeah, John Adams. Uh, I don't know who that is. I don't even think I can say his name. You can see it looks um, looks like it was cleaned. It definitely was cleaned. There's no question about that. Um, and you have this one. Which doesn't look cleaned. Look at that. First strike. And we got Florida as well. Uh, down here, I think this is a gorgeous one. Um, this is Thomas Jefferson, and look at that stamp. Wow. The signing of the Declaration of Independence. And inside here, once again, you have the, the card and everything. Uh, these were pretty cool. This is um, the James Monroe. 
fifth president token. Um, some more commemoratives, the Lib Statue of Liberty. Uh, anniversary of the Titanic. This is the uh, American Civil War 150 anniversary. These ones I found pretty interesting um, because not like these. These ones had a little stamp on them. So I found that very interesting. Um, Found that very, very interesting. I didn't understand why these have a stamp, but those don't. And then we got this one. This is the George Washington. This one was a little damaged, uh, at least the envelope. And it didn't come with the certification stuff, but uh, you can see it still has the mint. Uh, it's in the mint cellophane and it's still perfect. Um, the 73 uh, is the same thing. Uh, I can feel that it doesn't have the um, certification um, and it's one-sided. But uh, it looks like it was probably on a um, a board. It was glued onto some type of board. Um, Canadian. Uh, yes, we have a bicentennial Canadian quarter. Um, this stamp is so phenomenal. I think it's so phenomenal. Uh, Indian of the Plains. Uh, look at those. Look at that stamp. The Indian going after the um, buffalo. I also got this right here. It was uh, the last U.S. Um, of the second millennium, which is, um, let me see if I can shine that, 1999. Uh, pretty nice. Um, that nickel looks like full steps. So I don't know if I can actually show it, but that nickel looks like full steps. I will check it under the scope. Um, and check for errors, you know, and the rest. But um, then I also picked this up because <clears throat> I am a Yankees fan. Yes. So I grabbed this. I thought this was pretty uh, nice. I only paid $3 for this. So um, that's going to be a keeper. So all the same players. And then uh, back here, there's a few other ones. So thought that was pretty interesting and nice <laughs> and my father-in-law came and gave me this and uh, well he didn't give it to me he wanted me to appraise these and uh, find out what those are worth and uh, I'm not sure but um, I thought they were pretty interesting so I figured I would put them on the um, on the camera for you guys so there's a whole bunch in there um, some 80s uh, tops, you know, all different kinds, um, fleet, but, uh, <clears throat> yeah, it was pretty interesting. I thought that was cool. And last but not least, what I did do was I picked up some fidget spinners and made a fidget, uh, penny fidget spinner. Check this out. What? Now, isn't that pretty cool? That would be something good to give to your uh, grandchildren or if you're, or your children, um, or even if you like it yourself. Look at that, isn't that pretty cool? Hold on. Well, it's gonna keep on spinning. It's gonna keep going, let me stop it real quick. Let's, let's do the back. And I set it up and, ooh, look at that. And a nice pretty case, I got cases for them. Guys, are you ready to win some? <clears throat> let's uh, spin the back now. Let's see how long it spins for. Should we do a spin competition? Hold on, let's do a spin competition. Spin competition! Let's see which one spins longer. Uh, uh, looks like this one's slowing down. Oh, no. Caught momentum. Where are we going? Where are we going? Whoop. I don't know who's going to... Oh, it looks like this one's... Oh, no, that was interference. Interference. Looks like he's still winning there. This one looks like it's slowing down a lot. Yeah, he's slowing down. He's slowing down. Interference, and this one wins. Still. 
pretty cool, huh? Don't you want you, don't you want yourself one? This one's still going. Pretty cool, huh? Let's see. Isn't that cool? It's a penny fidget spinner. Sick! It's a penny fidget spinner. What? Yeah. I want to do one with an Indian head scent, a weedy, a memorial, and a shield. That would be pretty cool, right? Thank you for watching the Flea Market Coin Hunters, and don't forget to comment that secret phrase. If you'd like a free entry into tomorrow's giveaway, make sure you email me at fleamarketcoinhuntersgmail.com. Somewhere inside that email, make sure you title it giveaway so you can get entered into tomorrow's free giveaway. Once again, thank you for watching Flea Market Coin Hunters, and you guys have a nice day. God bless. Happy hunting. Hashtag Penny Fidget Spinner!